you're gonna start by placing your guavas into a pot. To the guavas, you're gonna add in about three quarter cups of water. Now you're gonna let this simmer here until the guava is nice and soft, very tender. So after 15 minutes of cooking, the guavas are very soft and tender. What I'm going to do is, I'm going to move this off the stove and allow it to cool down completely. Okay, once the guavas have cooled down, you're going to take your guava and put it into your blender or your food processor. If your guava mixture is thick, you may need to add a little water to help it process. Okay, now you want to return that period guava, but first I'm going to put it through a strainer just to get any seeds that I probably have missed out. So guys, just place your um, strained pulp into a bowl and set it aside. In the pot, you're going to place your one quarter cup of water that you have remaining. To the water, add in sugar. So just on medium low heat, let this melt. Okay, when the sugar has completely dissolved, you're going to add in your guava. Mix this in. Now you're going to add in a few drops of food coloring until you reach the desired color that you would like. Now guys, you want to be very careful when you're cooking this because it can splatter because it's a very thick batter. So you want to keep stirring this on low until this starts to thicken up. You just want to keep stirring and stirring just to ensure it doesn't start to stick and burn at the bottom. You want this to thicken up even more. 